Hello all and welcome to the third episode of my battle spot adventures. Today for my first five first battles in the battle spot I had four of the battles against a team with a Mega Kangaskhan. So today was uh, really some kind of Mega Kangaskhan battle day. I really don't like Mega Kangaskhan because it's so powerful and usually I always lose with them. But I chose to record this one battle when I actually won against one. My three Pokemon for the battle were Carbink, Castrodon and Gudra, and the battle was against someone Japanese Yukari with Gardevoir, uh, Kangaskhan and Talonflame. I'm starting with my Carbink and she's starting with her Talonflame. This is actually a very good setup for me because my Carbink does well against Talonflame. She's using Tailwind and that raises the speed of her team. And I'm going with Power Gen because that's my most powerful move against Talonflame. It should go down with two hits. Yes, her Talonflame is now down and she's coming out with her Kangaskhan, which right away Mega evolves into Mega Kangaskhan. The baby is really cute, but I still don't like the Pokemon because it's so powerful and it always hits two times. And it makes my Pokemon to flinch very often, so I don't get to attack so much. It doesn't do so much damage to my carving because it's really defensive, and I get to use my Toxic to get the Kangaskhan poisoned, which really saves this battle. I don't think I would have won it without the poisoning, so Carbink did really well. But despite that, my Carbink goes down with the rock slide from the Ganges Crunch. And next up I have my Gastrodon. I was hoping it would do us a wall against the Ganges Khan, take some damage. And it doesn't take so much damage from the rock, rock slide, and but it gets flints, flints very often. I have leftovers on my Gastrodon, so it's regaining some health every turn. And the Gangaskan is taking the poison damage and slowly fading down, and then gets flints again. Lucky me. She's returning the Gangaskhan and coming out with her, her God of War. I really can't beat the Japanese so fast. I'm switching my Gastrodon because it doesn't take the psychic damage so well. I have my Kudra, which is my special wall, and it does better against the God of War. They used the light screen, so I was hoping the rock slide would do more damage, but of course it didn't do very much. But I'm using Thunderbolt and I get the Guard over paralyzed, but it has synchronized, so my Kudra also gets paralyzed. It's not really so big deal, but anyway. Kudra did well against the Guard over, but it fainted anyway. So I have my Gastrodon left, it should be able to manage this, and it takes down the card wall with one earthquake. Then we gain some health from the left hours, and she comes back with the Kangas Khan, which is really dying in a minute. It does quite heavy damage with double S, but Gastrodon survives with 5 HP, and the Kangas Khan takes recoil damage and it would have taken the poison also so it died and we were able to win the battle with some luck it was really thanks to the poisoning that we made it but anyway thanks for watching this and i hope you can leave a like or follow my channel if you like the video thank you